Hey everyone, and welcome back. Ever look at an old, bulky television and wonder how we got to the super thin screens we have today? It's a fascinating journey of technology, and it all comes down to two major players, CRT and LED. Let's dive in and see what makes them so different. Back in the day, every TV and computer monitor used CRT technology, which stands for cathode ray tube. Imagine a big, heavy glass tube, kind of like a vacuum bottle. At the back, an electron gun would shoot beams of electrons toward the screen at the front. This screen was coated with tiny dots of phosphors. When the electron beams hit these phosphors, they would light up, creating the pixels that formed the picture you saw. To create a full-color image, it used three separate electron beams, one for red, one for green, and one for blue. This process required a lot of space, which is why those old TVs were so deep and heavy. They also consumed a ton of power and got pretty hot. Now, let's fast forward to the present day with LED screens. LED stands for Light Emitting Diode. These screens are a type of LCD, or liquid crystal display, but they use LEDs for their backlight. Instead of a giant electron gun, LED TVs have a panel of liquid crystals. These crystals don't produce light on their own. Behind them, there's a layer of tiny, super-efficient LED lights. The TV controls which crystals to let light pass through and which to block. By passing light through red, green, and blue subpixels, it creates the final color image on the screen. Because LEDs are so small and efficient, the screens can be incredibly thin and lightweight. They also use way less electricity and produce much less heat. So what's the verdict? CRTs were groundbreaking for their time, offering deep blacks and great motion clarity. But they were bulky, power-hungry, and prone to screen burn-in. LEDs, on the other hand, are the clear winner for today's world. They give us razor-sharp images, vibrant colors, and sleek designs that fit perfectly into our modern lives, all while being more energy efficient. From a heavy box in the corner of the room to a thin panel hanging on the wall, it's amazing how far screen technology has evolved. Thanks for watching. If you found this interesting, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more tech deep dives. See you in the next one.